We just happened to pop into leader chuck systems at Mac 2018, and Roy, you've just bought one of the Piranha systems, but just yeah. quickly, what does your company do? Well, we, we manufacture a small racing engine, up to two and a half litres, um, it's, it's used mainly for rally cars. Uh, in Ireland, it's about one of our biggest customers. Um, and we find the Irish market is very aggressive on the cars. People like M Sport have to do special heavy duty suspension. And our race engine, we've had minor problems with alternator brackets breaking because they're going so fast and landing very heavily. So we're in the process of making heavy duty components for an existing engine. Okay. So I've been looking around the show today and this clamping system would be ideal for what okay. we're manufacturing now. So the Piranha clamp, now just, this is, what machine first is this going to go on to? It's going on to a five axis DMU Mori. Okay, so why specifically then, you've come past the stand, you've seen this, there's lots of work holding solutions around here obviously, why have you chosen this one? This might sound a little bit strange, but I met <laughs> Mark, chatted about it, and he said, Roy, we'll let you use one of these straight away. I've been trying to get one off another stand, and they wouldn't let me take it. Oh. So Mark said, take it Roy we know you're from Bridge North we don't really know who you are but he was good enough to say take it we'll sort the m money out on ah. the paperwork on Monday so we're away over the weekend we will be, we'll, this will be processed on the machine okay the model will be made and on yeah. Monday night those will be going out to Ireland okay well and we've got this all on camera as well so Mark's safe in terms of the invoice but specifically why Is that right, Mark? It's right. Okay. <laughs> but why why specifically this clamp that clamping system, because it's centre, self centres, yep. uh, so as you, you as you use it, it, it keeps to the centre. Yep. So we will have different size blocks of aluminium, and for the size of machine and the size of component we're making, that is ideal. It's not too heavy, but it's heavy enough. Okay. With the serrated edges, that will really bite into the alloy, so heavy cuts, it won't move. Okay. And don't need to pre-stamp, or you'll pre-stamp the, the billets? Yeah, we'll, we'll pre-stamp, yeah. Oh, okay. yeah. And also you mentioned, I think, the height of the actual, the, Clamp. We'll actually be putting this onto a higher fixture. We're probably rising it onto a 100 uh, mil okay. block, right? Uh, which we've got part made anyway. Okay. So tomorrow morning that will be fixed onto the machine. Okay. And that's the that's the reason I'm here and dealing with Mark. Fine. So nice, easy, cost-effective solution, and Mark was happy to give it to you straight yeah. away. That's good. that's good. I'm very pleased. The show is very good anyway. And guys like you doing these little interviews, it's it's all oh. good for every, good for the industry. Testimony as well. So thank you very much. <laughs> yes. Okay. Thank you.